Hey y'all, welcome back to the vlog today. We're in Garden City. We have been here before and you've seen us on the vlog before, but we are back. We're going to go inside the Pavilion Arcade, play some games, and maybe even go out on the pier later. Who knows? May take a little walk around the town here as well like we did last time. If you like this video at the end, give it a big thumbs up. Let's me know you care. Let's me know you like it. And if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can see all my future vlogs. I got some vlogs on the channel you can go back and watch as well. Hope you enjoy this one. Let's get this one started. We're going to go inside the Pavilion Arcade here. Play some games. Let's take a walk inside here. Here we go. Does this place look familiar? Let's go get a card. The fun begins here. Play with cash. Does not give change back. Purchase one fun e card. $20, you get $5 bonus play here. Insert. $20 in and we'll dispense my card. Spit it out at me there. Garden City Pavilion Arcade Game Key. Let's get started. And it looks like they have taken out some of the baseball games here. It only has two here now. Two machines. One and two is gone as you see the numbers two and four there. I've taken some of those out. We're going to play though. Right here. And almost an out, but it bounced back out, thankfully. And another foul ball. Got an out. One out. Oh, it bounced back out of that. Thank you. Thank goodness that was an out. It was going to be an out. That one's a foul ball as well. Double there. Brought one run home. Another foul ball there. And another foul ball. Double. Brought one home. Single. 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 Out. One more out to go. Got two outs now. Home run. Had a had a grand slam there. It took me up to eight. Single. Another single. Another single. Bases loaded. Oh, third out. That's going to do it for that. All right, guys, we're 124. It takes 25 to win. We're one run away with two outs. Wish me luck. Just one. We just won. 25. We're going to go for the Spider Man. Won the Spider Man. Uh, the regular one. Yep. Thank you, sir. One right there. 25. Won a Spider Man. And I finished it off with 29 runs. Got the spotty for it. That's my new record ever on these games. 29 runs. First time I ever won this, too. Won off this game. Awesome. Let's see what this does. The black hole here. Oh, it just got 10. It just got 10. Let's do it one more time. See if we can get it on around there. There we go. Try again. I hit it too hard. Too hard. Let's try the quick drop. See how many balls we can get in the cup here. Here we go. Uh, 
calculating how many I got there. Let's see. 34. And spin to win. Forty at forty. Forty. We're gonna try to win a duck. A duck. Right here. Let's try to win a duck. Nope. Uh oh. Wow, we won it. We won a duck. One of the ducks, one, two of them. I do have this awesome Three Stooges Whack a Stooge. It's currently out of service. A lot of their games are out of service right now, but that's awesome. We used to love watching Three Stooges. Play some old fashioned ski ball here, though. Let's play. to play the gold fishing game here. Try to get it in the... Let's go. Oh, it's so close. That one was so close. We got 825 points, though. That's going to be 20 tickets. I have won again, guys. I have won it. Again, we're going to get the black spotty this time. Going for the black one to go with the original. And we won the black one this time around. I'm going to play some basketball here. Here we go now. It's going to start in a moment. Here we go. 40 seconds. There it is. Higher. Stuck. The ball stuck. I got cheated. I got cheated. Y'all saw I got cheated. We're gonna go over here to Sam's Corner. Get us a hot dog. Let's go. Just a little look of the inside here. Back here they have uh, this cool looking clock as well. It's an awesome clock. And they have a hot pizza by the slice sign out here. They don't even serve pizza here though. This is what we're dealing with folks. Sam's Corner, chili and cheese, hot dog and some fries. I got the ketchup. I'm going to put some ketchup on my, on my dog here. I don't want to put too much. Right there. Let's try it out. This has been featured on the channel before. Every time I come to Garden City, I like to eat here. Alright, let's try it out. Pay no attention to my nose. I was in the sun yesterday and I had a blister come up. and It looks awful today. Oh yeah. Sitting outside here on the uh, patio at Sam's Corner, looking across at the pier. 
and I have some killer tea here in Sam's Corner as well. We're gonna try this dog out. Pretty good. really good. I love Garden City. It's part of my childhood and used to come down here every summer as a kid. So I enjoy coming out, walking the pier and looking at the ocean from the pier and all the beach houses and stuff. It's not all, you know, like all hotels and resorts like it is in Myrtle Beach. So yeah, it's something different. It's old school beach, I guess. All right, and that was Sam's Corner here in Garden City. And like always, delicious even the tea even the tea delicious there's the iconic mural of Garden City Beach over there on the side of Garden City Beach bar and grill I love that mural uh, one of my favorites down here last time I was here we did not go into the fireworks store though I'm gonna walk in here and check it out see what all they have a lot of fireworks in here check that one out cowboy cowgirl up right there the red swarm a lot of them looks like firework complex they got some more back here the big one here three wishes five twelve shots 21 shots right there just got a bunch of fireworks in here and some as you see a lot of them over here they have some well, some more but then they have some seashells over here this store has been here for years the store was here when I come here when I was a little kid so I'm gonna walk in Eagles and check it out as well while I'm here I haven't been in this Eagles in a long time. It's the only Eagles in Garden City. So let's go check it out. Of all your beach souvenirs, hoodies, Myrtle Beach hoodies and lifeguard hoodies and what have you. Some seashell there. Little seashells right there. Over here you can get all your little whatnots. And snow globes all your snow globes or a little whatnots they have all kind of beach towels beach towels to galore so you can get about any beach towel you want here you also have your t-shirts over here hats everything says Myrtle Beach you think being in Garden City they would sell Garden City merchandise but most stuff is Myrtle Beach pretty sure they're all owned by the same family same person I can check that one out that's my favorite one up there the Toy Story towel I'm a huge Toy Story fan they have all your Myrtle Beach postcards as well too Remember before before cell phones and stuff came about my grandparents would always send me a postcard from everywhere they went and they used to go out like, on tours out west and stuff because we're from the east coast as well and um, I still got postcards from like Arizona uh, Mexico Texas South Dakota North Dakota so yeah I still have all mine some people don't even send these no more now we're gonna go up on the pier at Garden City. Let's see what's going on up here tonight. He was playing on bicycling, rollerblading, pets, skateboards up here. Sorry, but you're locked out. No, none of that. None of that here. And here yeah. is the view off the pier, folks. We're not even halfway down the pier. And you can see as far as the eye can see out there. Here's the beautiful houses. A lot of people still on the beach at this time. 
it's beautiful down here in Garden City. I love coming down here and uh, spending time each time I come. The moon up there in the sky and that beautiful, beautiful sunset. That's so beautiful right there. Really like it. He was planning on coming out here and feeding the sharks. We'll have none of that here on Garden City Pier, it says. Do not feed the sharks. I got really got out here to throw his line out. Here he goes. There it went. Now what he'll do is he'll let the slack out as he goes back and he'll paste his, place his pole in that right there. That right there, just like this one over there. All right guys, and I'm closing this one out at the Gretel Candy House. And you ask why? Check this place out. It looks like a gingerbread man house. All your candies up top. Candy cane doorway there. It's real cool looking. Got the candy cane. You go ahead. Got the candy cane man right there. Up there. It's real cool looking. All your little chocolate. It's awesome looking on the outside. I haven't been in yet. This is the first time I ever stopped here. And up here, you have a witch with the broom here stirring the old pot of candy, I guess. Is that candy? Who knows? Then over here, photo op. A whole family, gingerbread family here as well. Right there. This thing is cool. I had to stop to show this building off. Who would think this would be right here in Myrtle Beach? This is the side of it. Just regular on the side, kind of. That's pretty awesome, yeah. Gretel's Candy House here in uh, Surfside, I believe this is. Not quite in Myrtle Beach. Let's uh, walk in and take a look at the inside. On the inside, they have the chocolate going around as well. You know, I'm just here for the candy. In the middle of the store, they have this tree right here with the top being candy they set little props on or whatnot up here on the wall they have red robin hood with three bears up here cinderella oh well that's not cinderella but i don't know what that is never gotten that but then they have the three little pigs the big bad wolf charlie wonk over there some more people behind the counter they have this great mural of a candy house with candy trees there. Awesome. Here at the Gretel's Candy House. They have a whole section for you jelly bean lovers. Big can of bean boozled. boozled. All these little bean, bean boozled here. Pretty cool. All right. I opted out on getting any candy. I just really wanted to show this magnificent building off it's awesome i believe love how it looks like a gingerbread house over on the side it's just has some candy canes back there just like they do on the roof there but it looks awesome yeah all right guys that's gonna do it for here on this one hope you enjoyed our time down in garden city today Sam's Corner, the pier, and the game room took you in the Eagles, and even the fireworks store. I forgot about that. And then all here in Surfside at Gretel's Candy Kitchen. Gretel's, right? Yeah, Gretel's. It's an awesome building. Here with me and the slot back here. My lips are blue because I ate uh, Roberto's Italian ice just a few moments ago, so all blue. Here with the Take a take a screenshot, it'll last longer. Alright. That's gonna be it here for this one. We'll see you. Oh, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button. If you like this one, give it a big thumbs up. Let's me know you care and let's me know you like it. Here at Gretel's Candy Kitchen. This one's over. We'll see you in the next one. I did not see these. Are these like Hershey Kisses? With gumballs on them.
as well as they had this painted on the side, Cinderella's Castle as well. And over here, didn't see none of this. Like a candy land over here on this side of the building, along with what you could see if they took the tree down. Look at that. A train with a gingerbread man driving it. And they even painted up the door that looks real nice. All right, guys. We'll see you next time.